Is someone sucking up to Donald Trump? It sure looks like it. On Thursday, May 16, Matt Gates, an American lawyer and politician who has served as the U.S. representative for Florida's first congressional district since 2017, showed up to the ex-president's hush money trial. In one photo, he could be seen in the background as Trump, 77, spoke to a group of reporters. Standing back and standing by, Mr. President, Gates captioned the snapshot via X, formerly known as Twitter. In response, Trump critic Ron Filipkowski wrote, It's pretty difficult to get more pathetic and culty than this. Others also weighed in on the picture, with one person saying, You look like a cult member wearing your little Trump suit. Makes me want to work harder to get at Joe Biden elected. You people are an embarrassment to our country, another person fumed, while a third user added, This is so pathetic. Later on, Filipkowski joked about all of Trump's allies attending the trial in New York City. The MAGA minions showing up to Trump's trial are helping to prove the prosecution's case that his greatest concern is not about protecting his family or his brand, it is about how this situation will impact an election. As OK previously reported, Filipkowski thinks Trump's pals are showing up in the hope they become his VP. Trump is obviously telling his VP hopefuls that if they don't show up and say whatever he wants them to say, they're out. It's like the dumbest version of The Bachelor, Filipkowski wrote, referring to Vivek Ramaswamy and Mike Johnson. Others also agreed with Filipkowski's prediction. One person wrote, he also believes I'm sure that having prominent politicians appear on his behalf, sitting in a courtroom might make a good impression with the jury, while another joked, and all dressed like twins. Meanwhile, former White House Communications Director Michael Duck believes Trump is using proxies to get around the gag order imposed on him. Why are they there this week? Asked Duck. If I had to guess, it's because they are watching a prosecution that's flailing and a case that may turn 12 Manhattanites into individuals that are acquitting Donald Trump in this trial, and they want to be part of that. I think there's a lot of timing here. I don't think it's necessarily all this, the way that it's being described, as auditions for the VP spot. I think there's multiple things that are happening,